What's up guys, Shane Sars here with Droid Modder X. Chainfire has finally released a systemless route for Android devices. Now this covers 6.0.1, 6.0, and some 5.1.1 devices. Rooting your Marshmallow device is now super easy. I'm gonna show you how to do it. Let's go ahead and get started. All right guys, so this is super easy. Of course, you're gonna need to be bootloader unlocked with a custom recovery installed. Now getting that custom recovery installed is going to be different for various phones. I'll be sure to include links in the description of how to get the custom recovery working on the 6P, which is the phone that we are doing this video on. The Systemless Super SU works on all devices that are capable of flashing Super SU in recovery. Uh, you'll just need to make sure that you already have recovery installed. Okay, the next thing you want to do is head to the link in the description and grab the latest beta Super SU uh, version 2. Dot six five. This is super simple and easy because we no longer have to flash a modified boot image. So prior to this root method on Marshmallow, you would need to flash a custom boot image. So you would have to do that on your computer. You'd have to flash it through fast boot and you'd have to set up the SDK on your computer and do all of that. Um, here, all you have to do is flash the super issue file. So you'll download that. Next up, you'll boot into recovery. Okay, so to boot into recovery, you're just gonna hold volume down and power on the 6P, it's different depending on the device that you're using. Okay, and then we're gonna go into our recovery mode. Once in recovery mode, you'll go to install and you install the latest version of Super SU. Um, I have 6.4 downloaded here. Okay, and then all you have to do is swipe to confirm the flash. Okay, so you see this message here, it says important notice, if Twerp offers to install Super SU, do not let it. So when we click the reboot system, it may ask us if we want Twerp to install Super SU. We're gonna say no, so go to reboot system. Okay, here's what it's talking about. What you wanna do is click do not install. So that's very important. If it installs the older version of Super SU, it can really mess some things up on your phone, so it's best just to not install that. We've already installed Super SU when we flash that file. Okay, once everything's loaded up, you can launch root checker, verify root. It's gonna ask you for the super user request. We'll go ahead and grant that. It just means that we are indeed rooted on Android 6.0.1. So just to show you guys, I'll go into settings, about phone, and the Android version there is 6.0.1. Guys, that about wraps it up for the root method for Android 6.0.1, 6.0, and 5.1.1. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmoderx.com. Follow me on Twitter at droidmoderx. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.